We have a wonderful video request. You say, hey, why is it wonderful? It's, it's wonderful because I like it when you young kids, you kids, kids under 25, when you come to me with questions that show that you haven't fucked up your life and your, your options are good. It's not like, oh, I knocked up this chick, what do I do? It, well, here, I'll show you. I mean, none of his options are bad. And so I'm happy to see this. So let's see if we can't find the best option here <coughs> uh, for this uh, young man here. Hey, asshole, I'm 18 years old and in my first year at Community College of Philadelphia. I'm doing decent in my classes and I have a 3.7 GPA. All right. I am dependent on my parents and I have a part-time desk job as a parking garage gate cashier at a hotel, so I have a lot of time to study. Smart move. There you go. There you go. You're doing it right. My question is, should I transfer to a four-year university to do nursing and see how I like it as a career and then maybe pursue dentistry, or should I take the less time-consuming route and go for computer science? Or hold it, hold it, hold it. All right. One. Stay in community college, get all your crap out of the way, the, the prereqs and all that. Get your two years in, all right? I know a lot of you want to go to four-year universities because that's where the action is. No, there's no action. It's bullshit, okay? It's like community college, except more expensive. And maybe the women are slightly hide, uh, hotter. <laughs> but get your cheap, get, your, get as much classes as you can at your community college to get the cheap credits and then go to the four-year university so do so do that don't be in a rush to get out of community i mean don't stick around there forever but find out all the classes you could take uh they'll transfer get them there pay the least amount in tuition and then go to the four-year now listen to your statement i don't know if you saw, thought this through should i transfer to a four-year university to do nursing and see how i like it as a career and then maybe pursue dentistry you're going to go into nursing and then dentistry no, no, choose, choose. There's no, I'm going to go get a degree in nursing, I'm going to go get a degree in dentistry. You don't have unlimited funds or time. Right? Between the two, dentistry is the higher paying one. That is definitely the more higher paying one. I know nursing is, is still a very fine degree, do not get me wrong, but there's a lot of people that go into nursing. And plus, with nursing, there is a lot of progressive credentialism. You got to get a ton of certifications. You got to stay current. I got several friends of mine who are nurses. They make good money, wonderful women, very truly independent women to look up to and respect. And yeah, men, but most, they're all, not most, all the nurses I know are women. And, and maybe there's an advantage to that. Maybe you're the only guy there. But, you know, worst things have happened. <laughs> Beats going to become an electrical engineer. I, but, um, they're always getting tests to do something because you can't fart in the medical industry without having a license to do so. So that's something to consider with nursing. Dentistry, not that you, you there's not certification or qualifications or testing, um, but there's less dentists, they're much higher paid, you could become self-employed, and the regulation is significantly less than the medical industry, even though there is regulation in health. Um, but I know my dentist, I personally know her, a friend of mine, uh, and she's making good money and she just fresh out of uh, dentistry school started her own practice didn't even bother going under somebody's tutelage and she's making bank um, so I'm, I'm very pro dentistry seeing what she did of course now she's a very hard-working woman she uh, she's entrepreneurial and she did it right um, but I, I am very pro dentistry. I'm maybe even more pro dentistry than than surgeons because oh god, I've gotten emails from doctors that are like don't do it. They go through the list of everything you have to like. Whoa, fuck that. Um, or should I take the less time consuming route and go computer science? Well, computer science again, not a bad not a bad choice. It, it really boils down to what you want. Okay, you're not gonna fuck up in any of these things. If it was me, I'd say dentistry because that's the most reliable. Uh, employable out of all of them. I know computer science is somewhat generalistic. You need to be more computer engineering or electrical engineering, but com computer science majors do not do bad. Certainly better than your fucking political science degrees. Uh, but you have to, you're have you allowed to have choice in this world. It's not like the labor market commands everything. Just most of everything. <laughs> but uh, ask yourself, do you want to be drilling into people's mouths and have blood and splatter? And, and if you're okay with that, cool, you're going to make a lot of money. Or are you okay? more of the computer science geek? It, it really is up to you. Uh, great videos, by the way. I wish I discovered you a long time ago. Dude, you're 18. You discovered me just in time. 
it's when people are 50 and I mean then there's true tragedy that they didn't but uh, you're down the right path no matter where you go I think you'll be all right um, just uh, yeah ask yourself a couple questions see what you don't, and here's the thing while you're at community college take some computer science courses see if you like it uh, that that may bang out you say oh god I don't like it it's so boring uh, and then maybe that will put the focus on dentistry or nursing so uh, anyway best of luck I don't think you're gonna need it toodles